Hi, my name is Ronald Barzola from Lima, Peru. So we are Tourismo Lab. Let me tell you a French story. This is Carlos, a professional graduated from tourism management three years ago. Since then, he always was looking alternative to improve his studies, but he didn't find anything he was looking for. He found in his region, four hours away from he lived, just one course. But this one was too expensive and too long and not always available because he had to wait for a group to start. In summary, a few options, bad quality and poor offline offer to keep studying. Despite there are many digital platforms at internet, there is no, no one specialized in tourism and specifically in Spanish. So that's why we create Turismo Lab. Turismo Lab is the first online school for professionals in Latin America. We have more, uh, students at more than 10 countries. We started in Peru and we are expanding to Mexico, Colombia, um, some neighbor countries. We have courses and micro degrees online programs in different topics like tourist agency, entrepreneurship, tourist fundamentals, gastronomy and restaurants. Um, hospitality. So, well, this is like, look, platform four. Uh, we have video classes. We have different uh, professors. Our courses have an average ticket from 19 to 39 dollars, four to six hours. There are actionable courses and our customer acquisition cost is three dollars. Uh, our market is really promising. We aim to just 20% from all of it that equal, is equals to 150 million. We have different competitors, not only in Latin America, also we research, at, we research some competitors at Europe, but we have four attributes that are, is our di differential, like actionable courses, asynchronous courses, affordable prices, and learning community. So right now we started like nine months ago and we have like 12,000 sales in dollars. We have more than 75, 70, 150 online students, more than 15,000 new users, and we aim to finish the year with more than 20,000 new users, more than 100 online students, and $20,000 of sales. We have some aliens like Pacific Alliance, Wadwani Foundation, our incubator startup Uni from Peru, and some blog, uh, tourism, tourist blog and community locally. Our team is, we are uh, complimentary. Clarissa Victorio is our CFO, Chief Business, Chief Business Manager. Eric Honorado, he's Tourist Manager and CEO. Edwin Palacios, he's the CTO and Systems Engineering, and I'm Statistics Engineering and CEO. So that's why our with our proposal, we help Carlos and all tourist professionals to keep studying, keep and never stop learning in his life <laughs> uh, to develop more tourists. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you a lot. So, have we any questions from the side of our jury board? That's our last participant for today's event. And um, so, so I, I, you know, the obvious one is the tourism has taken 60-70% hit. Matter of fact, South America is the most impacted continent because of COVID. What's the game plan for you to get through this? Yeah, we know. Actually, we are starting. We we were growing our sales, our users and, and students because of the COVID. We stopped uh, having all the like a startup scaling. Now we we are trying to uh, prepare more content, uh, contact more international professors. So when all these months or, or COVID situation pass, we can offer a, a big contact, uh, actually contact to, we are like reorganizing all the strategy to expand to different countries. So yeah, the, you know, also because the COVID is an opportunity, so we have new topics to learn, to teach, so yeah like biosecurity, bio, bio uh, all the laws about the, the new tourists. No? So yeah, it's also an opportunity for us.